Minfos gives you the ability to send e-receipts to your customers via SMS for transactions performed at the till. To send an e-receipt via SMS, enter your clerk code as normal, and then ring up the items for sale. If you have rung up scripts for sale or scanned a loyalty card, the customer will already be selected. If you have not selected a customer, you may either click select customer and then search for the customer, or proceed to payment without selecting a customer. Next, select the tender type and process the sale as normal. The e-receipt window will display. If the customer does not want an e-receipt, click escape and process the sale as normal. If the customer would like to receive an e-receipt via SMS, continue with this workflow. The customer's mobile phone number will be pre-filled from the profile that was selected last. For example, if you scanned a customer's loyalty card, then added scripts to the sale, the mobile number stored in the customer's local profile in Minfos will display. If you have not selected a customer before processing payment, manually enter the customer's mobile number in the field. Check that the mobile phone number displayed is correct. If required, update the mobile phone number. Then click Send. If the mobile phone number needed to be updated, the Update Customer's Details prompt will display. This enables you to overwrite the phone number stored in the local Minfos customer profile if you wish. To do so, click Yes. The customer profile will be updated and the e-receipt will send. This function does not update details in the customer's loyalty account. Follow your normal process to update customer's contact details in the loyalty system if required. If you do not wish to update the mobile phone number in the customer's profile, click No. The e-receipt will send and the change window will display. Click e-receipt to send another copy of the e-receipt. Click reprint docket to print a paper docket or click OK to start a new sale. Minfos also gives you the capability to send an e-receipt from any screen where you can inquire on a sales transaction. This flexibility allows you to easily send e-receipts for past transactions if required. For example, in the sales inquiry window, select the transaction that you would like to send the e-receipt for, click inquire, and then click e-receipt. Confirm or enter the recipient's mobile number and then click send. The e-receipt audit log contains a record for each e-receipt transmission for the past 30 days. This report may assist you in troubleshooting e-receipt issues or inquiries. To access the log from the TIL module, navigate to reports and select e-receipt audit log. The default display period is 30 days. This can be adjusted to a narrower time frame as required. Click OK to run the report. The report displays the sale details with the mobile phone number displayed in the destination column. The result column displays the status of the e-receipt transmission. Success means that the e-receipt has left Minfos and been transmitted to the third party provider to be sent to the customer. If the record shows the correct mobile number and the result success in the e-receipt audit log, but the customer has not received the e-receipt, please contact the third party provider for assistance. If the result shows the correct mobile number and a result of failure, it means the e-receipt was not able to be transmitted via Minfos. Resend the e-receipt via the sales inquiry screen and if still unsuccessful, please contact Minfos for assistance. 
For further information about e-receipts in MINFOS, please visit the MINFOS Help Centre.